Hey everybody, it's me, Danny, running with scissors, bringing you my final review of the Adidas Audi Zero Boston 11. All right, once again, final thoughts on the Adidas Boston 11. I now have 200 miles in the shoe and uh, gonna continue to keep it in the rotation sparingly. So let's get into my final thoughts on this shoe. Uh, we'll start with the upper of the shoe. It has a very synthetic feeling upper, gusseted tongue, very stripped down in fashion. So it is breathable, but there's just not a whole lot there as far as comfort or plushness. And I think what they're trying to do is save weight uh, where they could. The shoe comes in at almost 11 ounces. So it's a little bit on the heavier side and I do wear a size 11. Uh, midsole has the dual density light strike and light strike pro so you are getting a dual density foam and outsole uh, continental rubber on the outsole along with these plastic rods uh, that you can visibly see that run through the sole of the shoe um, as far as what my thoughts of the shoe are uh, first thing that i see a lot and of course i'm going to say is it's a firm shoe so if you are looking for a firm shoe, if you're the type of uh, runner walker that likes a firm shoe, this is right up your alley. I prefer something just a little bit more on the soft side and a little more on the responsive side. I attribute a lot of the firmness to the outsole. Um, these uh, sections of the continental rubber are very firm and in conjunction with having these rods run through here, the, it's just a very firm ride. The um, foam itself does not have a lot of compressing. So you can kind of see there, I'm having to really push on it just to get to try and compress a little bit. Um, you know, the actual, you actually feel this uh, foam here and you know, it actually does have a little bit of nice softness to it. But once you add in uh, these other two elements, the outsole, uh, the rubber, the uh, uh, plastic rods, it just makes it a very firm ride. Um, thoughts going forward, uh, if the shoe continues to stay just like this, it's not one that I would purchase again, um, but I'm really hoping that uh, it, there's feedback that is heard by the designers and uh, hopefully that maybe they can bring a little more balance to it. Uh, this is a, again named after the Boston Marathon being the Adidas Boston 11 and I really hope that they do uh, really try and bring this more for marathoners out there especially as far as like comfort and uh, responsiveness goes. So again that's my final thoughts I want to thank you for watching till the end and We'll see you in a video soon.